picture of Joshua Gimon was prominently placed near the altar at Holy Cross Lutheran Church this morning. Buttons with this picture were worn by members of the congregation. And following the service, a tree was dedicated in his name. I want to thank everybody for all the support. And this tree is a reminder that Josh is out there somewhere. There's been no body found, so we got no reason to believe he's dead. 21-year-old Joshua Gimon was last seen leaving a party on St. John's campus around midnight one year ago today. A year later, the case is still open. Josh's parents, grandparents, and friends are trying to keep hope alive, believing Joshua will eventually be found. Where does this hope come from? Oh, well, must just come from being his dad, I guess. You got to keep working on getting the answer every day, you're doing something. We're all still thinking of Josh and still praying for him and remembering him. Katie Benson was Joshua's girlfriend for nearly five years. She has spent the past year keeping Joshua's picture and memory in the news. Wherever I go, Josh is with me and his memory is with me and I'm still trying to get the word out. And that's, it's really hopeful when you see a lot of people show up for this or when you see someone wearing his button or when you see someone wearing his ribbon or when people ask about it. You know, I guess after the, Initially, you know, you got to figure it's going to be a while, but you always hope it's not going to be as long, you know. Never was thinking you'd be standing here today a year later not knowing any answers. <laughs>